According to Caritas PNG summary report, apart from extensive costs incurred by the PNG Electoral Commission in running the elections, there's been a huge increase in campaign finance expenditure. The electoral process is an important mechanism in democracy. It provides avenue for competition and rivalry, which is vital for the existence of an effective multi-party system like PNG. Financial resources are important for this whole process. Political parties and candidates need money to campaign fairly and equally. However, undisclosed campaign funding can damage the process that leads and follows an election. Despite the loss provided by OLIPEC, little is known about how much political parties and candidates collect or spend during elections. Even the source of the money is not known. Some parties, especially the older parties, that are you know walking around with so much money, while there are many on the other side of the scale that just don't have any money to spend in the election. So what we are trying to do now is to make sure that this particular part of the only point only pack is tightened. Caritas campaign finance project attempt to try to address the issue of money in politics in PNG circumstances. The data collected shows there's continuous increase in campaign expenditure, undisclosed campaign income and expenditure, vote buying and abuse of state resources. It's hoped the report will be used to improve future elections and will call for transparency, accountability and good governance to prevail. The completion of this report was made possible. I believe that this document and the information contained therein be used to make necessary changes in the democratic process of PNG. By International Foundation for Electoral Systems through funding support from the United States Agency for International Development. Carolyn Ure, National MTV News.